I think the beauty of Roger Nielsen House is we are a children's hospice, but we are so full of life and fun and laughter, and play is the essence of that. And this space didn't allow for us to have as many kids as we would like, and the sound quality wasn't there in the old playroom. And I think this room allows us to play in a whole different way that these children may have never experienced unless we changed the room. The inspiration behind this space was a magical tree house. That's the Tate tree, and that tree was brought into this room in order to bring life and love and community. And the fact that this tree can bring all those elements together is such a legacy. So we wanted a lot of sensory stimulation for the children and families in this room. So we have swings if the kids want to swing with their friends, or they can just lay on, we have grass carpet or nice laminate flooring that they can touch and feel. And then there's music everywhere in the room. There's different shadows and light fixtures and things that kids can look at, um, specifically up above the children too, because they often are looking upwards. So we wanted them to not look at just the ceiling, but look at something magical and inspirational to them. To me, the wall is a really powerful representation of my journey with Roger Nielsen House from the first time I came here until really until present day. I think the little glass stars are just like our children. I think they're unique, they're special, they're precious, and as a parent, nobody wants their child forgotten. So for me, the wall is a tangible sign um, that my son's life is being honored. We are who we are because of our team here, because of our families, and because of our community. And the community contributions, whether that's contractors, or builders, or designers, or even just people who came to give us advice and constructive feedback on the design, we wouldn't build this beautiful playroom without community partners in a lot of different layers. It's been a longer process than ever anticipated, but there was a lot of sensitivities involved in when you start doing renovation in a home like this that has many memories for families of their children. We're here now at the culmination of this wonderful room that is a legacy for my godmother to children of the future who may unfortunately need this room. They will come here knowing that there's lots of life left and this is one of the best facilities that you could possibly be in.